can you share a little bit of your daily routine somewhere around june to august how did you spend your day how many hours did you actually put in study how much time you spent in recreation like that explain to people so that they get a good idea okay let me tell you basically uh, i was not a kind of morning person mm. so i will be studying late nights mm. two or three basically all right then i'll be you know waking up around 8 or 9 like depending upon the time i have slept mm, okay so that is a, that is then... like morning person to a lot of people waking up at day <laughs> right okay but still yeah, you only slept for 6 hours do you continue yeah, that yeah 5 6 hours is enough for me 5 no. 6 hours is more than enough for me because in college also i was in a team called perians racing mm. so it was a, an automobile team all right basically it, similar yeah, to baha and all or uh, supra ah, yeah it was supra. not very much similar to baha but uh, it supra supra yeah. basically supra sai event right. we have to participate okay so we, we used to work at night in our workshops mm-hmm. then we are you know we are coming around 3 or 4 in the morning then we again going Correct. for class in mm-hmm. like at 8 in the morning mm-hmm. 8:30 in the morning mm-hmm. so you know we had only 3 4 hours or 5 4 hours mm-hmm. to sleep only so from that uh, part of my you know my life in college mm-hmm. I learned that thing that four, five, six hours are enough to sleep for sleeping. Mm. Uh, to have a good sleep, mm. and you don't need seven, eight hours. So All right. I, I function on that. Mm. It depends from so, person to person, also. Correct. Person to person, mm. basically. Yeah, you have to, you know, look upon yourself. Honestly, so, I also for, function better at six hours of sleep. Four hours is way uh-huh. too less. Eight hours is okay, yeah. but I'm at my optimum when I sleep only for six hours, right? So you'll you'll have to find out. I know few people who are best when they sleep like nine hours. So if if they sleep any less than that, then they cannot work throughout the day. So it depends yeah, from it person depends, to yeah. person. Yeah, it depends. Uh, you have to find out really what what works for you. No, it's six hours and nine hours. So basically, I I was there. I wake up at nine or eight. then i do some breakfast and all and then i then i stayed to back to my studies and i i try to take long sessions like 3 4 hours in a stretch okay 3 4 or 5 hours is possible in a stretch that you know it's very beneficial mm-hmm. you know because if you are not you know studying one hour then you taking 15 10 minute breaks then it distracts you a lot all right at least me mm-hmm. i am not a kind of person who you know who when i study one hour then take a break of 15 minutes or something mm-hmm. most of people do but uh, no i don't like that Same. so yeah. i read in a stretch mm-hmm. i study in a stretch right. like 3 4 hours mm-hmm. then i'll take a break for half an hour or one hour mm-hmm. i'll do my lunch or anything is next and all then again i'll get back to my studies and then in between break 3 4 hours sit break then break and then 3 4 hours then break Mm. till night i'll do that all right in between like i told you i like cooking mm. so if i get time so i cook some snack in the evening or some something that i like i have recently seen on youtube mm. so i try to you know <laughs> mm. recreate it all right all right lot <laughs> of kitchen, new recipes but, and all correct yeah mm. but they don't work <laughs> okay they don't work <laughs> my experiments don't it work. takes time <laughs> you keep at it yeah. all right okay yeah. so basically <laughs> whole day goes into studying only you study in 3 hour yeah. chunks right yeah. so i've talked about pomodoro yeah. technique before that uh, you can do this oh. like study for 25 minutes take 5 minute break that worked for me and that is why i asked the same same question to a lot of different people because different things works for different people because if mm-hmm. i study in a stretch or what i used to do if i used to study in a stretch for 2 3 hours then i saw a depreciation mm-hmm. in the concentration level okay, okay. but again on the other hand it, it, other people might yeah. find a drop in their concentration yeah. if they take breaks continuously okay yeah. you have to really find out what works mm-hmm. for you all right so after giving gate examination after 3 4 months after that most likely most of your syllabus must be over so at this time mm-hmm. were you mostly on your revision phase or giving test series and all those things practicing were you doing that now uh, uh, at that time uh, we are still at july to oh. august period yeah as it like or this yeah so again i took three four test series mm-hmm. uh, for gate yeah yeah so i i really believe that for gate you need you really need to practice yeah. there is no other way definitely so basically that is the only more, place that he has spent money in test series other than that <laughs> yeah, 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 another yeah. person who is And going to come up next is uh, rishi mm-hmm. rishi raj uh, he also did exactly the same he's all india rank 18 in gate 2021 oh, and yes. he yes. did not take any coaching He said the only place I spent money was test series, just like you. All right, yeah. Go ahead. Then you gave test series. Eighteenth rank is you know. Yeah. Very good. So in July I took three four test series. Then I started taking those test series and I planned you know 
my journey for the next six months. I didn't have dates till that till now, but uh, I you know tentatively I set some dates for me to do the examination, that examination. Then I started preparing. There was no other there was no other prep that time. So I started preparing to just.